2018 was a devastating year for California in the wake of mass shootings and the state's worst wildfires. On Sunday, Hollywood A-listers like Adam Sandler and Jamie Foxx and some Major League All-Stars got together for a celebrity softball game to raise money for families affected by the mm -hmm. tragedies. They teamed up with the YMCA and E! News' Jason Kennedy was there. This is California Strong. The charity was created by LA natives and Milwaukee Brewers Christian Yelich, Ryan Braun, and Mike Moustakas. This is my community, man. I mean, Malibu and a thousand of The group kicked off an inaugural softball event with some of Malibu's most recognizable faces. It started with a simple group text, and now we're here, and it's happening, man. We were sharing information to see if our, our homes burned down because there were road blockages, no service. Once we realized that we were okay, we quickly turned to wanting to help others. Last November, within 24 hours, California experienced a deadly shooting in Thousand Oaks and the most destructive wildfires in the state's history. This has been a crazy year. We ourselves were out of our house for several months because of smoke damage, but half of my son's class lost their homes like literally have no homes to go back to. This is a great example of how people can help each other when they all come together. You'd think pro athletes and celebrities could handle a friendly softball game, but I was picking up on some anxiety. We're as prepared as we can be. I think you might see some professional baseball players swing and miss today, so hopefully it's entertaining for everybody. I'm just kind of want to get in your head here. We got softball game. Yeah. Um, we, we really need you to step up, man. It's going to be a bad day for Sandman. Sandman's body's stiff. My kid said, please do well, and that put pressure on me. This is going to be awful. <laughs> I used to be good, though, I swear to God, in Little League, but it went away after that. I believe in you today, right? I haven't played softball in 25 years. I'm not kidding you, and I'm really afraid of getting hit in the face with a ball because this is this is my money maker. This is this is gold. Good hey, hey, hey. Charlie Sheen also came to support the cause. I grew up in these parts, so there was that night when I couldn't find my parents. You know, yeah. I finally used social media for. For something good <laughs> and speaking of social media we're still trying to figure out how dennis rodman gets by with one of these because i got these flip phones baby <laughs> why are you still using a flip phone more, man you can't get instagram on that can you oh, hell no but there's a good cause man you know there's a good cause no matter what what the, what the situation is you know people are always in, in trouble and in need four families who were victims of the fire received ten thousand dollar checks as well as Brian Hines, who owns the Borderline Bar and Grill, where the fatal shooting took place. I can imagine it's probably uh, a little overwhelming. Absolutely overwhelming. It takes away from that day and the hurt that me and the families and everybody feel. You know, this, this means the world to all of us. We're the smartest people on the planet. Figure out a way to not violate anyone's rights, or figure out a way to stop these mass killings. And so that's my thing. Yesterday's event raised over $1 million. You know, this isn't just a short-term, immediate, you know, relief thing. And we're going to keep helping out, and, and we're here for the long run. So you may be wondering who won. Adam Sandler's team won, after all. And the sellout crowd gave its longest and biggest applause to the first responders, mm -hmm. of course, who do so much for their community.